Okay. Seems like we're playing. <laughs> Back at it again with a good game. So, 2020 has been a little crazy. I guess. I don't know. I've been camping a lot for 2020. The Witcher's contact in Velen was to be Hendrik, the Emperor's spy. Hendrik okay, was so. operating incognito in that war-ravaged land. His mission, to gather intelligence about Ciri. Yet Geralt arrived too late. The Wild Hunt had reached Hendrik first. The Witcher learned nothing from the spy's corpse, but the wraiths had failed to find his notes. Geralt read them and knew that Ciri had been a guest of the Bloody Baron, a local warlord. And that she'd quarreled with a witch. Yes. <laughs> um, I'll do a live stream soon. So my channel has been staying at the same size. Eh, which is okay. It's good to know that some people like watching. Or just don't have my... Have my notifications turned on. <sighs> I kind of wish I had my, like my own profile picture instead of in, in using like f views from Rainbow Six or just glowing eyes. Tart Trotsky. Kind of want like um. Just want like a pic picture of my cat wearing like wearing like Soviet officer uniform that'd be unique okay so we're doing the botulin so that's gonna be fun Blood's power, I summon you. With your name, I beseech you. Hear my call and arise, Dea. Lead me to those bound to you by blood. Okay, so, yeah, I think a lover can, must be terrifying to people who don't know what the heck is going on.
Sure wasn't lavender they kept in there. Might be worth looking around, though. Water. So wait, um... Is my... my con... yeah, it is. Okay, so... can I... Yeah, I have no skill points available. Can I make anything? White honey. Yeah. So that white honey is actually very simple to make, and I really like that. Uh, with crafting, can I make anything? Steel swords, silver swords. No, they're just. Oh, see, silver ingot. Oh, that's why I, I thought. Sorry, I've been playing this game at my other house on a Switch and. Is that steel? Yeah, it's a steel. Is that better? No. So if I find a steel ingot, that's just gonna be good. What's that? Oh. Alright, sorry. Um. change in here yeah marks of an extremely big horse a bracelet one of them must have dropped it a bracelet one of them must have dropped it part of me would think hey I should pick that up kind of bring it to the Horseshoe. baron no way a pitch burner could afford a horse. Both were here. I'm going the right way. Wants to show me something more. I shall follow you to the ends of the earth, Lubberkin. No, no, no. I don't want to deal with an insect. You Lubberkin, can you go any faster? Fine, I guess I have to deal with an insect. <laughs> Army just doesn't like the idea of enlarged insects. Which is sometimes why I have a hard time playing Fallout. I'm not an insectivore. Show me what you got. Necrophages and field prey. Still with a closer look. Examine the dead knight. What do we have here? Okay. 
Bones have been here a while. Chewed on the saddle. Necrophages will eat anything these days. You are not wrong. Giant claws. Wasn't a necrophage made these marks. Horseshoes missing. Is this the animal that lost one in the smokehouse? Head torn clear off. Takes incredible strength. Let's summarize. <laughs> Must have been attacked by a powerful beast. Surprised him. Hope they got away. You know, I feel like Geralt Trail would be on. a really nice Good thing it doesn't end here. ELA teacher. Let's summarize. It was obviously, <laughs> it was obviously, um, a lesson, judging by the details. Disappear, wolf. Oh, it's a, it's a coming. I can see on the map. Lubberkin, run fast. Fly faster, you have the ability. Oh. Awesome. me to take a closer look. What's up? Who's that? At the room. Go on now. What you seek here, sir? Our hut's out of the way. Woeful. We has nothing. We knows nothing. Just need information. Looking for two women. The Bloody Baron's wife and daughter. Not a soul have been here, sir. Sure. Not even passing through. Daughter's medium height, about 20. Her mother's thin, about 40. Seen them? That sir came at night, right, mummy? Quiet, boy. I want to help that woman. She could be in danger. Young and see no one, my lord. He's a kitty. Must have dreamt it. I want to hear this dream, then. So, kid, who did you see? Who came here? Pappy brought her at night. The lady does the medicines. She was all afeard. Talked about an awful monster. Said she had to go back. Don't know where to. Mummy and Pappy cheered her up. Gave her clothes. Hers were ragged. Where'd the girl go? Your son said enough. No point in playing dumb anymore. Sorry, sir. But you don't look like one of her father's men. Because I'm not. I'm looking for Tamara and her mother. I need to know if they're alive and safe. Tamara is high. She's to my brother's place in Oxenford. But Mrs. Anna, that's another tale. Though anywhere's better than to crow's perch with a baron. Why? Cause, cause he beat her, sir. Beat Mrs. Anna, I means. Everyone knew, but not a one lifted a finger for to stop it. What happened to Tamara's mother? Were like this. I was awaiting in the old smokehouse with horses. Cold as hell and so dark, couldn't see past two L's in front of you. Moon had risen high, and still they hadn't come. Began to fear some demon had snatched them. But finally they came forth, and we set off towards the river. Suddenly, out of nowhere, a gale arose. Thought it'd tear my head off. And those damn birds, swarms of them coursing o'er the woods, raising a racket to make your ears bleed. Mrs. Anna screamed, bent over into herself. Tamara knelt down, gripped her arms. For then I saw it, fiery marks on her hands. Fine, what happened next? Grew even darker. Seemed someone had put out the stars. Crickets all went silent of a sudden. And then, from the woods, a roar. Broke out in a cold sweat. And before I could catch my breath, a beast jumped out of the woods, big as a barn, with horns and two burning coals for eyes. I thought I was done for. 
beast attacked Mrs. Anna's horse, ripped its head off, carried her off into the woods. Our horses, mine and Miss Tamara's, got spooked and tore off willy-nilly. Twa the only reason we escaped. The miss wanted to go back for her mother, but my wife pleaded, said she'd die out there alone. Miss Tamara agreed not to go. What marks? These, well, like burned on with hot iron, on the palms, inside. Burned? Like a cattle brand? Aye, no, these wasn't black scars scabbed over. These hot and glowing, as if they burned with raw fire. Why help them at all? You risked a lot. I'd a debt. Old Miss Tamara. Three moons passed, a fever gripped my boy. We thought he was done for. Tamara learnt it. Brought food and salves. We're poorer than dirt itself. She saved my boy. No two ways about it. Me, myself, I'd have never dared to help. But my missus told me, a time of war and contempt's come. A time of folk gone wrong. We needs to repay good with good. Who stands by idly does evil as if. Married a wise woman. Crying shame we couldn't save Mrs. Anna in the end. Thanks for your help. The lady. She'll be all right in the end, won't she? I'll do what I can to see that she is. <laughs> is anyone worried that the children spawned out of nowhere? So here our paths diverge. Thank you, Dea. Go in peace. Level five. Yeah, that's why I get I get to become level five. Um, yeah, I changed my skill tree a little. Whirl is a really good like um is a really good stance to fight with. Where's my favorite gourmet? Yeah, this one. He's saved my life multiple times. But there's good alchemy. I really like um oil preparation. Um Oh, well, yeah. I have been helpfully informed that the channel has been deleted, that my brother hasn't. <laughs> um, high intolerance. Okay, so I'm probably gonna upgrade. Hmm. They don't know who to upgrade. Yeah, I'll upgrade my um my Igni. I've always been one for Igni. Burn him alive. I'm so glad it's not, not so the 4th of sure. July. I mean, not the 4th of July. Um, if That's I remember it, correctly, Roach. they still have the, um... On... Not so fast, Roach. Okay, so during, not um... Roach. April 1st of... I think it was 2017? No. Yeah. Um... CD Projekt Red inserted a... A purse where um, just this weird glitch where Roach will 
spawn anywhere in the weirdest positions. And I remember playing during it. And I was so confused why it was more glitchy than usual. Oh no. I remember you. I think I lost you the first time I ever met you. <laughs> ah, Carter! That's what I thought. Halt! Stand in Jew! I challenge you! Boots a bit big, maybe? Careful not to trip. Halt, I say! I am Ronvid of the Small Marsh, bound by a sacred oath. Oh, that's rough. My sympathies. To honor Maid Bilbury, fairest of all maids I know, by dueling a hundred knights to the death. Now, draw your sword post haste, for I have 99 left after you. Okay. At your service. Let's get this over with. Oh jeez. I forgot. You know, I yield. Had enough? Yes. Looks good with you. But but the next time we meet. Go back to mate Billberry and apologize for being an ass. Quick, before I change my mind and break your bones. We shall meet again. Signer signature look of <laughs> supremacy wait the supremacy why don't you why don't you disappoint why don't why don't you three disappointments kill that drowner please thank you Glorified thugs, I remember. I was about to say, why are they all so rude? Then I kind of remember who the Baron is. So I learned. Your pale as out is shine. Oh, thank you. So I learned that I can't film over 60 minutes, otherwise the PlayStation uh, editor that I use won't allow me to upload it to the internet. Piece of honor to this sweet. Ooh, fist fights. I love fist fights. They're always my favorite thing. I don't know about horse races, but I got fist fights. I'll get more. Yeah. Remember me? Stable hand pulled you out of the fire. We'll never forget that. Here. I'm grateful. Wow. He makes me feel so nice inside. Shut up! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Witcher, a word, please. What is it? That night when the Baron ordered everyone to lock their doors, stay inside. What did you and the Baron do? Gotta ask the Baron about that. Speaking of which, know where he is. Garden. Spends a lot of time sitting there of late. Drunk. No. Don't drink, don't eat. Just sit. Do I sense depression? There he is. There you are. See the hollyhock there? The violet blooms. Brought the plants here from Nazaire. Anna had read some story. Insisted on having them. 
Spent hours tending to them, trimming, pruning. She was so content at that. And them, the frilly ones, were called birds of paradise in Zerakania. But Tamara called them dragons of paradise. She adored them. Damn shame I'll never learn which blooms would please Daya most. Oh, it's good to know her spirit's free. Your loss. It must hurt. Bad. But there wasn't anything we could do. No. Not now. Not anymore. It was too late. That was clear. Should have acted earlier. Taken them all from this damned villain. In this hole, this reesty mire, nothing could go right here. Got some information about your family. You've learned something? Well, let's go inside. It's a bit chilly out. Any news for me? Your daughter's in Oxenford. What the blazes? Is she all right? In good health? Safe? Why haven't you brought her back? Never offered to do that. How do you know she's safe? You see her at least? No, but I talked to the man who helped her escape and then took her in. Tamara is safe and sound. From what I gathered, she has no desire to see you again, no intention to return. I shan't trust some peasant dolt. I shan't trust whoever it is helped her. I need to know for certain she's safe. Go to her. You must be sure. See her yourself. I shan't believe anyone else. That much I can do. I'm grateful. Take this. Call it enticement. And this might prove useful. What is it? A letter of safe conduct. Ever since the Redanians took hold of the Pontar Delta, they made it damned hard to get to Novigrad without one. Very well. You were to find them both. What of Anna? Learned anything? Nothing yet, but I'm on her trail. Well, what are you waiting for? For you to tell me about Ciri, like we agreed. <sighs> Fine. A word once given. When Ciri was on the mend, we took her out on a hunt. Thought a bit of galloping would warm up her limbs, gone stiff from so much bed rest. That lass of yours, pure luck in the flesh. To hunt down a wild boar that size, why, worthy of one of King Foltest's feasts, were he still among the living. Sere, come! Our haunt should be yours as I see it. Oh, you're doing well, lass. Not bad. Not bad at all. But who goes boar hunting with a sword? No bow at hand, no spear. My sword was all I had. <laughs> well, you brandished it beautifully. Where'd they teach you that, anyway? At Care Morhen. Witcher school there, I. But they only took lads, as I recall. I'm not a witcher. Just grew up there. I believe it, seeing how you swing that sword. Know any of them potions? Not so much. A bit. Because, you see, at times I get this pinching back here. Shut it, Egrin. Nobody cares about your backside. A woman could swing a sword. I've nerd one. But never seen a lady mount anything but a cock proper. All tipsy on horseback. Nothing strange on account they bloody mount them sideways. Perhaps you'd care to wager? Think you can outrun me on an horse? <laughs> Naturally. What's the stake? Black mare. The one in the stable. Oh, that won't do at all. Well, that's an awfully gloomy face. Too much of a coward to race a woman. The horse is mine. To race the Baron himself. I'd consider it an honor. Oh, that'd be a sight to behold. Would it ever? Done. But if I win, 
I take your sword. Agreed. I'd not drink any more this night. You want your head about you. We start at daybreak. is getting like scared because I know what I've played this is gonna be a decision that comes up probably later probably in episode 10 judging by how slow I am but it's gonna come to, to a very big decision and that's you guys will learn ready as ever First one to the tower. Man chop! Come on, Siri, don't you embarrass us! That was fun. How much more time do I have until it reaches an hour? Wow. She screamed like a mad woman. In an instant, all had forgotten the wager. Every man ran to save his skin, even were he to break his neck. And they make it? Some, aye. Others were not so fortunate. But what happened then? I must say, Witcher, seen a lot, but nothing like this. Never. Uh-oh. I know that look. You're a fast learner. You'll know the rest once you find my wife. Working on it. And making piss-poor progress. They split up. Hadn't considered that possibility before. But don't worry. I'll find Anna, too. So long. I'll play, uh, I'll play Gwent later. So I can absolutely destroy him. Hopefully I get like a bunch of subs soon. Wait, Witcher! When you find my daughter, will you give her this? A ragdoll. Uh-huh. Alright, so let's see like how far I can get before it reaches think I got scared, or it's too late. So I need to start with the witch side quest, which is uh Mets. So I'm I'm gonna try to be looking around to see if anyone near me knows how to make videos so I can start making history videos. And like I should probably make a second channel. Cause this is kinda why I wouldn't 
I'd probably name it the same exact thing, but just change this to like gaming with a, a historian. I don't know. We'll see if like we could do, you know, those the here and there. Oh wait, why am I not using a horse? Roach. Run, Roach. Okay. So, by my calculations, we should reach Oxenford in, in a bit. some um, good old-fashioned Leshen flashbacks. Leshen's terrify me. Redanians. Oh. How do you fellow Redanians do? <laughs> how do you do- how do you fellow Northmen? You know what's really funny? Um... King Radovid of Redania has basically an empire yet he doesn't call himself emperor I think in boy I shouldn't spoil the ending at all but like it just I don't know was he born in the Romans yeah I yeah 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 guys I'm trying to make good time on this Oh god, no, 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 now, ghoul. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Drink some apple juice. Who wants some apple juice, boys? No, don't slow down. Girl. We're near a monster nest. I'm telling your horse to slow go, down. Go. Oxenford. I think my good old friend, um, Roach is near. Not like my horse, but like a friend. Read the books in The Witcher. Read everything Witcher. This is my favorite fantasy. It's better than Tok it's better than Tolkien oh, no, and Martin. Bad, Boom. I am out of your way. You can shut up. Passage. Case of the plague surface in the city or something? The plague? Uh, no. We're to not let folk in the city. It's an order, so I don't. Unless someone's got a pass. This what you mean? Let me look at that. Mm -hmm. uh, missing a seal. The red one. Impossible. Department of Civil Defense forgot again. They're really off their heads these days. Happens, so be it. You may come through. Come through. Yes, let the mutant mercenary of death come through. 
I mean, like, I am a good person, but, you know, I have two swords on me, I'm, I have creepy eyes. What Makes sense. That? Don't tell me what to do or cut off your head. This game makes me happy all the time. Also makes me sad sometimes. <gasps> haircut! I'm gonna get a haircut! Probably off, off um, screen because... for Tamara, the Bloody Baron's daughter. Your brother said I'd find her here. Voitex sent you, sir. How else would I know she was here? Wait a moment. I'll fetch her straight away. Fun fact, cats don't like witchers. Cats are kind of like dragons. Read the short stories and math. I'm begging you guys. And who might you be? My father sent you. Yeah, to see if you're still alive and well. I'm Geralt of Rivia. I'm quite alive and extraordinarily well, Geralt of Rivia. Better than I've ever been in this rotten life of mine. And now that you've seen me, I bid you farewell. Wait. We've nothing more to talk about. got every right to be angry at your father, but he's worried about you. I have a right. Thank you kindly. So good to have the approval of his hired thug. And my father worries only about what to get soused on next. He's no saint, that's clear. But he's got the whole province on its feet looking for you. Finding you and your mother? Seems to me there's nothing more important to him now. I know evil men. He's not one of them. Shame he never showed such concern before. Especially for my mother. He made a mistake and knows that. I'm not defending him. Just saying that maybe he's come to realize what he's done. And what you mean to him. Oh, wonderful. I'll bear that in mind. Did you really come all the way here just to tell me that? Before I agreed to look for you, your father told me his version of events. Tell me yours. Mine? It's dull as life amidst the swamps. My earliest memories are of a drunken father lying under the stairs, caked in mud and clutching a bottle. Next dozen years, pretty much the same. Father would drink, disappear for days, then come home in a rage and send furniture flying. Thank the gods for war, I was glad every time they sent him off. And the quarrels. I remember him screaming at mum, the thuds as he beat her, then her sobbing. I'd hide under my bed and long for silence. That's the long and short of it. Multiply by 19 and there you have my life. Finally, we'd had enough, Mum and me. He crossed the line and we fled. I don't mean to pry, but I know your mother had a miscarriage. His doing? He shoved her, she fell, that's how it started. We were alone, no one to help. Blood everywhere. Worst night of my life. Sorry. Must have been hard for you both. Mum was in shock. She was raving that it was better this way, that she never wanted the charge. Must have had a fever. She was losing blood the whole time. She didn't want the child? Said she'd sooner cut open her gut than bear another child from his seed. Wojtek claims your mother had strange marks on her hands, and that a monster dragged her into the woods. Is that true? We were riding towards the river. Suddenly, Mum cried out, bent over, almost fell off her horse. I rode up to her and saw something strange. Her hands were on fire. And then that creature leapt from the woods. I don't know what it was, but it roared so fierce my nose bled. I saw it topple trees. I've never been so scared in my life. And that... that thing grabbed my mum and disappeared into the woods. I wanted to turn back, go after them, but the horses panicked. Now I don't even know if she's alive. 
What will you do now? Find my mum. You realize that might not be that easy. Don't worry, I'm not daft enough to believe I can do it alone. I've got some new friends now. Powerful friends. They'll help me. Who are these friends, if it's not a secret? No secret. Heard of the Church of the Eternal Fire? A priest helped me contact the Redanian witch hunters. Righteous, brave men. They'll help me. Hence the candlesticks in your room. So you believe in the Eternal Fire? Once the heat of the fire has set your heart aflame, it gives you strength and leads you down the path of truth for the rest of your life. I hope it'll bless you with its warmth one day. Thanks. Thing is, fire's tricky. It's easy to get burned. I hate the... Mm. I hate the church and the fire. They, they suck. What about your father? Who? Oh, him. I don't care. I won't go back to him. That bit of my life? Forgotten it already. Well, well. <laughs> the Witcher. Never thought the Baron would stoop to hiring a monster slayer. Though I hear you're good at tracking things down. Glad you know who I am. Haven't introduced yourself, though. Graden, witch hunter in the service of His Royal Majesty Radovid of Redania. I'm certain you've heard of us. Rings a bell. If the bloody Baron sent you to fetch his daughter, you'd best face it. You will fail in your task. I appreciate your concern, but I don't need it. As for Tamara, she can make her own decisions. Hmm. <coughs> Noble of you. A killer for hire abandoning his bounty for the good of another. The Hunters and the Church of the Eternal Fire thank you. So the Baron hired a Witcher to find his daughter. Interesting. Desperate fathers have been known to do a lot to find their daughters. Unexpected from a Witcher. <coughs> I thought your mutations cleansed you of humanity. Stripped you of emotions. You don't need mutations to strip men of their humanity. I've seen plenty of examples. Where are you going to take her? Tamara must rest. She's had a harrowing experience. When the warmth of the eternal fire has restored her strength, we shall see about finding her mother. Before you go, your father asked me to give you this. Clara? Father told you to give me Clara. Funny how he thought to buy me back with a memory. Tell him one gesture could never make up for a ruined childhood. So long, Witcher. In spite of all, I'm... Well, I'm grateful you gave me a choice. Didn't force me to go back to the tyrant. Hope you know what you're getting yourself into. So long, and good luck. Okay, so I think I'm gonna end it here, guys. We're very close to um ending this um, this quest line. Well, family matters. But not really. Uh, because this, because this entire mission also is connected to another mission. So yeah. Um, we're gonna quickly get a haircut. That I'm done. Greetings, master. I've got a razor and. Oh, perfect. So this is how I like my Geralt. So long. I like this haircut. It's just really good. It, it looks
looks better with better uh, armor. So, yeah, that's gonna end it. Thank you for watching, whoever does. This is, remember, this is one of my favorite games ever. It's one of my favorite fantasy books. I love the comics. My favorite, by the way, my favorite sci-fi is the Dune series. Anywho, guys, I hope you enjoy yourself and have a good day.